A neighborhood is on edge after a shooting sends a man to the hospital. And now Hendersonville police are hoping someone has information that will help them find the gunman responsible. News Channel 5's Kimberly Davis explains how the overnight shooting took residents by surprise. A usually quiet neighborhood was the scene of an overnight shooting investigation that sent one man to the hospital. Neighbors say they thought they heard fireworks, but when they walked outside, it looked like something you would see out of a movie. At least 10 police cars. It looks like there was either a crime van or a SWAT van. Dozens of officers on the lookout for gunmen. But to make things even more confusing, when officers showed up on the scene, the victim was nowhere to be found. We were not able to find the victim right away. Uh, so what we did from there is we made all attempts we could to find the victim. We were able to locate the victim in a hospital. Hendersonville police say the overnight shooting at Autumn Creek off Anderson Road was targeted. But when officers interviewed the victim, he said he did not know the shooters. And for residents who live in Autumn Creek, something like this is out of the ordinary. No, we're not used to seeing stuff like that here. So you can see where it ended up. David Smith was so one of many residents who didn't know what here. sounded like fireworks like erupting. Glass from the window. Was actually gunfire. I had no idea what was going on, so you don't expect something like gunshots in your own neighborhood. So I still wasn't really thinking it was gunshots, just trying to figure out what was going on. But that uncertainty quickly changed once Smith stepped outside. I came outside to see what was going on, and I saw a... Uh, a car parked over here on the side of the curb and his back window was shot out. Residents are hoping this is just a one time occurrence. It really was hard to fathom that it was actually gunshots. And police catch the people responsible soon. In Hendersonville, I'm Kimberly Davis, News Channel 5. The victim is expected to survive. Call police if you have any information that will help the investigation.